This is part three of the care and maintenance of the one cylinder two stroke cycle gasoline powered chainsaw. In part three, we'll be discussing the pull cord and magneto. Refer to the SDFD Academy Truckside YouTube channel for more information about the rest of the saw. To start, remove the bolts and notice that the longer bolt goes through the chain break. Make a note of it for when you reassemble the saw. This here is the flywheel and magneto. The flywheel creates airflow through the power head, so make sure this stays clean. The little black box is the ignition control module. It's responsible for sending a spark to the spark plug wire that allows the saw to fire. That little metal strip next to the flywheel is the magneto. Any issues with the magneto renders the saw out of service, so it needs to be tagged and sent to Fire Station 23 for repair. If you need to clean the area in there, use mild soap and water and wipe down with a clean rag. Next, inspect the pull cord cover the pull cord handle, and the recoil spring assembly. Pull cords typically fail in one of three ways, either at the handle, mid-span, or inside the recoil spring assembly. If the cord fails at the handle, simply feed more cord through the hole and retie the knot. If the cord itself or the recoil spring assembly fails, then tag the saw and send it to Fire Station 23. Be specific when describing what the issue is to help personnel at 23's fix it. Wipe the cover clean and reassemble. Remember, the long screw goes into the chain brake hole. When you're done reassembling, the saw is ready to go back in service.